We've also had an anonymous text for you, Luke. Would you ever consider playing your rugby abroad? And have you ever been offered a contract abroad? Um, that's a very interesting question. <laughs> um, yeah, that must mean yes. <laughs> um, well, no, it's just uh, in, actually in the middle of that at the moment, you know, but I really, I leave all that stuff up to, m to my agent and he's actually very, um, I'm actually with Finton Drury with Platinum One and he'd be very adamant on keeping me separate from that and uh, actually it's funny from you were saying that, like, so from the obviously from the negotiations I don't know how good I'd be at that but um, it's actually himself my dad would be uh, obviously like the decision is mine um, towards the end but uh, himself my dad would try and keep me separate from that especially at a time like this uh, even though it's it's time for contract negotiations for me um, they really want me just to focus on the rugby. So I suppose I'll probably be involved in the last kind of ditch stuff. Right. But um, Do you want to stay? Oh, well, I mean, obviously, like, I absolutely love Leinster and, uh, and love Ireland and all my family are here and everything like that. So, um, but? Um, well, I mean, like, there's, always, uh, there's always scope for that. And I think um, at some stage, absolutely, I think it will be a great experience, uh, not just for, for me rugby-wise, but for me personally to, to test myself in a different environment, you know. But... Um, Parlez-vous français? <laughs> but, <laughs> <laughs> That's not bad. That's more than I had gone um, to France. I don't know. L listen, it, it's uh, it's all up in the air at the moment, you know. But um, like I said, I kind of try and stay uh, apart from that until obviously final decisions have to be made.